know about the uh, morning and evening ashkar which we do so sometimes uh, uh, for example that 30 time allah was for 33 time alhamdulillah and uh, and and three time kul in the morning three time kul out the rabbil falak kul out the rabbil nas and we do sometimes i i forget the the three three times sometimes i increase sometimes i decrease and i need to read it all over again so is it permissible or do we need to stick with the numbers like 33 times three times three times um, first of all heidi you are confusing the morning adhkar with fajr prayer adhkar the fajr prayer adhkar is like any prayer adhkar you say subhanallah 33 alhamdulillah 33 allahu akbar 33 and then you say once la ilaha illallah wahdahu la sharika lah lahu al-mulku wa lahu al-hamd wa ala kulli shay'in qadir this is for fajr dhuhr asr maghrib and isha prayer in the morn and also after fard prayers we say qul huwa allahu ahad once qul a'udhu bi rabbil falaq once qul a'udhu bi rabbin nas once now when fajr or morning adhkar and evening adhkar we don't say subhanallah alhamdulillah akbar this is only for fard prayers but we say the three quls qul huwa allahu ahad qul a'udhu bi falaq rabbin nas three times each I can combine both if I say my morning adhkar after performing fajr prayer. So instead of reciting 111 for fajr prayer, then three times for morning adhkar, I can combine and just recite three quls three times and that would suffice. Likewise, Ayat al-Kursi, once after every fard prayer and once in the morning adhkar. If I recite it once with both intentions, that would suffice. Your question is, what happens if I make a mistake? Do I repeat it all over again? The answer is no. Alhamdulillah, if you're doubtful whether you recited it two or three and you added one to make it three, then actually you recited it four times, there's no problem in that and Allah knows best.